when I was uh, in grade school, I'd often be looking out the window studying the clouds instead of studying uh, the text in front of me and would get caught out by the teacher to see whether I knew where they were in the readings and things. Usually I, I keep track of that a little bit, but uh, mainly looking at clouds. Uh, so it's, it's, uh, it's interesting to me that that was what I end up getting paid for is studying clouds and aerosols uh, much later on. Um, my teachers would maybe be a bit shocked that uh, maybe they should have encouraged me to look out the window more. And then uh, in, in science, I always like to um, play with gadgets. So in high school, I built what's called a spirometer, which is just something you breathe into, in and out, and a drum goes up and down, and I attached a, um, a strip chart recorder to that and recorded the, the breathing, and then figured out things like residual lung capacity and so on. Um, and, and all these years later, I see that aerosols in the atmosphere are impacting people's breathing. Asthma is an increasing problem worldwide because of pollution in the atmosphere. Uh, oftentimes those connections are unexpected, so you get studying some little detail and you find out later on it's connected to many different things that are happening. Um, so I always love nature and uh, always love to tinker a bit. And so tinkering got me into building telescopes and uh, using microscopes and trying to see nature at different scales. And uh, been doing that ever since.